If you're absolutely clueless about how you should run your ads, don't panic. I'm going to help you with this new app that is called Lexi AI. Now, Lexi AI is an ad creation AI that is really, really amazing. I tried it and I want to show you exactly how it works and what you can learn from it. Now, let's get straight into that app. Now, I'm sure you can see my screen. Now, let me say this quickly that I wasn't paid by Lexi AI to do this video, but I'm just doing this video because I stumbled upon this AI platform and I think it's great, okay? So let's look at how to use it. So I just uh, did the sign up. Uh, you can do the sign up with your email and then you would be taken to this page where you can create a project. So I'm going to create a project. Now, basically, the way Lexi AI works is that you need to have a website before you can start using it. So um, I already have a website from one of my clients, which I'm going to paste right into this space here. I'm going to paste the website right here and then I'll click on start your ad campaign. So basically what Lexi AI is going to do is that it's going to analyze the website for us and then it's going to help us to generate different ad ideas. Now, let me give you a brief background of this, my um, client. So basically my client is into furniture. So uh, she sells home furniture, offices, dining tables, and all those things, generally furnitures. So you would see how Lexi is going to be able to recognize that brand based on the website link and also be able to gather information. This platform is really, really mind blowing. And I need you to try it for your own ad as well. It it might not be that you want to use it directly to run your ad. It might just be that you want to use it to get, generate ideas for exactly what you should be doing when you run your ad. All right, so now you can see Lexi AI is fully loaded. Now it's saying that the page you want to promote, it has put the website link and it says the project name, Luxury Custom Furniture Excellence, right? Let's just call it that. Now, it also created a brand introduction, product or service description and selling points. Created all that, right? You can see it here. Created all that by itself. Now, let's also scroll down. Now let's look at the ad plan. So let's say saying that we should do a traffic ad that is going to generate leads, okay? Now, so this is it, okay? And then Lex is also suggesting a $20 ad budget. Um, this is it. Now we're gonna choose the city and the countries to advertise to. It's very simple, just click where it says cities here. We're just gonna click that, okay? So I'm gonna just type in Lagos here and then I'm gonna select Lagos, Nigeria, okay? So once we do this, once we select Lagos, Nigeria, we can scroll down, we can select more than one, but I'm going to select just Lagos, Nigeria here, and then I'm going to scroll down, and then I'm going to click Generate Proposal, just right here, Generate Proposal. So we're going to wait for Lexi to generate the ads and generate a lot of things that we're going to be using. Let's just wait and see how Lexi will do. All right, so Lexi has been able to generate for us five ad sets, five ad sets. So if you think about it already, you know that what Lexi is saying is that if you want to create an ad for this, my client, if I want to, I should create five ad sets. So five ad sets, one campaign, five ad sets. So let's look at the first ad set. Now the first ad set has what it calls the audience description. So Lexi is describing the audience. He's saying that we should target middle to upper class homeowners in urban centers like Lagos, Abuja, and Portacot who value high quality, customizable furniture and stylish home decor solutions. This is smart. This is smart, right? Now, let's look at the age. The age is 30 to 55. Now, if I were to run this ad, I probably would not do 30 to 55. But Lexi is saying 30 to 55, and thinking about it, 30 to 55 seems like the age that will respond better. Now, gender, it says all locations, it says Lagos, okay? Now, let's look at the audience tags. What, do we, what does it mean by the audience tag? The audience tag is Lexi trying to give us a list of interests that we can use for our ad. So, if I click on this one, it says owner occupier, oak furniture land, home decor, the living room furniture, uh, slumberland furniture, uh, Ethan Allen, Kirkland, CB2, um, C um, furniture village, sofa works. So, all these are all interests that we can use for our ad. Now, okay. So, now let's look at to the other side of my screen. You can see the ad copy right here. So, the headline is discover bespoke elegance for your home. Then the primary text is transform your urban space into a masterpiece of style and comfort. Our customizable furniture and home decor solutions bring your vision to life, to life, sofas, beds, dining set, lighting, and more tailored to perfection. So this is really like the, uh, the primary text that we can use or the caption, whatever it is you call it. Now the video is not here. We can probably um, add a video, but let's look at the second ad set. So let's look at the second ad set. The second ad set here is 
The audience description is business professionals and corporate decision makers looking for premium customizable furniture and decor solutions for commercial spaces such as offices, hotels, and restaurants. So now, the age again, 30 to 55. Let's look at the audience tag. Laser engraving, wall decor, decal, office supplies, office depot, uh, office max, smart star furniture, vintage furniture, luxury, lux interior. So these are all the interests. So now, it has also given us another ad copy and primary text for this second ad set. Now, let's look at the third ad set. Young professionals and emerging entrepreneurs aged 25 to 35 interested in luxury living. So now, this is 25 to 35. Now, if we look at the audience tags for this one, we're seeing Villa, we're seeing Monaco, Giuseppe Zanotti, we're seeing Bank and... So these are like the Yacht Week. So these are interests that it feels like would help us get this result. Now, let's look at the fourth ad set. Social media savvy individuals who actively engage on interior design, luxury lifestyle, and home improvement content on platforms like Instagram and Facebook. So what I'm saying essentially is that I can go on and on to check all the ad sets and you can see exactly what Lexi is trying to do here, which is to give us an idea of who we should be reaching out to based on the business and the website that we, we, we imputed. And it's giving us an idea on things like the age, the gender, the interest, the, the copy. So all you can do is, I mean, this could just be your ideation platform. Even though you might not want to use the platform to the end, it could give you just a clear path as to how you should create your ads by the time you're setting it up. I hope you've learned something from this video. Let me know what you've learned and how you're going to be implementing Lexi AI on, I mean, your own ad campaigns. Let me know exactly if you have questions or there are other platforms you want me to test out and review and also um, show you a few things about in the comment section. Thank you so much. If you have watched thus far, please help me subscribe to my YouTube channel and also give it a thumbs up. It tells YouTube that we're doing something amazing. Thank you guys and I appreciate you guys. I'll see you guys in another